Hi there. My name is Bob Christie and during the 1939-45 war I was a member of the 2nd 10th Field Regiment in the 8th Division. On the 15th of February 1942 we were captured by the Japanese and spent three and a half years as a prisoner of war. During this time we set up concert parties and as I was a young man with a reasonable voice I had some songs written for me to sing at these concert parties. I would say that nobody would know these songs so I've been talked into putting them onto this tape so that they may be kept. So after 63 years the voice is not what it used to be, but you asked for it, so here goes. Once we built a railroad, we made it run, we made it race against time. Once we built a railroad, but now it's done, buddy can't you spare a line. Then we built three bridges, driving in piles, itchy Nissan all the day, driving in foundations for miles and miles, just to get a daily pay. On the other side, walking to and fro, carrying our baskets full of earth, Idling our time and working very slow, but Nippon was shouting, Speedo, say don't you remember, we called it hell, it was hell all the time, say don't you remember, I'm your pal, buddy, can't you spare a line? I've got a New South Welshman, a Corporal Nelson Arthur of Annandale, Sydney, NX 31567. Now, Corporal Arthur is the gen man in the camp on all the inventions and the little ruses they developed to trick the Jap, such as radio and electric heaters and things like that. Well, now, here's Corporal Arthur to give you a little of the gen and how this thing was really worked. <laughs> Hello, Mum and Dad. Uh, uh, for the first two and a half years after we became prisoners of war, I had the privilege of doing the technical work on the underground radio installations in this camp, which provided us with the news and uh, the, the uh, way we went about tricking the Japanese was, was very interesting. We uh, got up to all sorts of ruses, such as hiding the radio sets in the in the roofs of uh, different buildings, um, working uh, radio receivers through the doctor's stethoscopes. Uh, oh, 101 different ways we went about disguising these radio sets and uh, receiving apparatus to uh, get the news through it into this camp. The radio equipment used was mostly of a breadboard variety. It was mostly made up from scrap materials which some of the boys who had gone outside the camp had managed to um, bring in. And uh, altogether it was a very good job. There was a tremendous uh, amount of work to be done at that time. We had so many sick and wounded and problems getting supplies. and. Uh, so that that sort of, you know, extreme sort of misery that comes over your soul when you find you're a captive, you're out of everything you wanted to be in. And uh, I found that the worst, uh, the worst affliction, really, of being a prisoner of war, the fact that, you know, you were just out of things, that uh, you were uh, vegetating in a corner of the world in which, uh, you know, so much was happening. Change the future of mankind, I suppose. Blue Australian skies And sunshine on fields wet with dew In dreams we see your beauty And greet our loved ones anew Blue Australian
million skies that smile on the bright golden grain. All our prayers will be answered, our dreams will come true, someday we'll come home again. On the wings of your gentle breezes, by the whisper of waves on the shore, tell our wonderful Mother Australia, she's a country well worth fighting for. Though we're far apart, the love in our heart never dies. God grant we all may soon return to our blue Australian skies. And that is it. Thank you very much.